Hey everyone, Midas here. In this video, I'm going to be playing all the mini games in Pixel Paradise, and I'll see if Pixel Paradise has changed for the better since the last time I played on it. Now let's get right into this. I also will be, you know, just like talking about Pixel Paradise in general during this video. Here we have landmarks. There's, I don't think there's any reason to look at these. So let's head right into the games. Since this one at the top is a new one, I'm gonna go and start at the bottom with TNT Run. Now, my opinion on Pixel Paradise is, I have no idea why you would purposely choose to play on this server. Because, like, there's a bunch of other servers on here that just have way more games and stuff. What's with this jumping? It's so weird. Like, I'm really floaty. Like, correct me if I'm wrong, but Pixel Paradise only has six games on the whole server. Like, there's just something wrong about that. I want to say this. I don't really play TNT they run that much because the servers I play on... Oh, okay, looks like I won. Like I was saying, the servers I normally play on don't have TNT run, but like, even I can tell this feels really wrong. Now let's head on to the next game, which is, I'm pretty sure, yeah, Spleef. But yeah, that's not really a hot take either, like, a lot of people hate Pixel Paradise. Especially with the fact that it's one of the main servers advertised on the Bedrock Edition. Like, that is such a shame, there's so many other probably greater servers that could have been used instead of Pixel Paradise. Correct me if I'm wrong, but it had like four games when it came out and that's another thing i need to mention some of these games are pay to play like you have to pay money to actually you know go through them so i won't even be able to play every single game on here so yeah pretty much with pixel paradise everything that could have gone wrong went wrong okay this is starting to not look very good oh oh my gosh I threw a single snowball. <laughs> oh, that was beautiful. All right, now let's head on to the next game. Guess who? Oh my gosh. Don't tell me there's only two players in this thing. In the whole... Okay, three. Okay, this is really sad that we can't find a full game. And it's taken this long. That is not a good sign that there are barely enough players to start a game. Okay, I'm a seeker. Okay, so basically this is just hide and seek. That's another thing. This might just be a me issue, but this server feels a lot choppier than the other ones. Like, I just feel a lot more lag when I play this compared to the Hive or Cubecraft. What? Ow. Oh, wait, it's this guy. I am so confused at what's happening right now. Seriously, I'm confused. What are these things? I have no clue what is going on. Okay, I died. Okay, so this isn't regular hide and seek. It makes no sense at all. Like, like, what are these things? You know what? There's no point in me staying here. Let's head on to the next game. Right now, let's head on to the next thing. Which is... Isles of Adventure. Oh my gosh. Is this like a whole big uh, game story thing? I have to go find carrots. How are people getting bone meal? This might be an interesting thing. I don't know. But I feel like this is way too much for just this video. I'm heading back. So I guess it's just like a game where you do a bunch of quests and stuff. And you gain skills. This actually does look kind of interesting. And I definitely say this is probably the best minigame I've seen so far. Because it looks like there's actual effort put into this. But anyway, let's head on to the next game. Alright, let's head on to the next thing, which is... Battle Boats. Okay, what's happening? Okay, this might actually be a little bit interesting. Because, like, I don't know every Minecraft minigame. But this doesn't feel like something that's just copy-pasted. It might be, I don't know, but this doesn't look poorly made. And the game didn't even start with enough people. I'm so confused. 
And great, I died. So I'm guessing you're supposed to just like not crash into uh, the back of the boats. Honestly, pretty interesting mini game. Looks like they tried to put at least a little bit of effort into it. So yeah, it's fine. Next game. All right, next game, Volcano. Now, if I'm correct, this is like based on another certain mini game. But to be honest, I don't know too much about it. So like this feels more new to me. I know that this is just like another ripoff of another mini game that exists. It's once again just showing that they aren't really that original. Now, please let me leave because I never want to come back here again. Okay, I just have to leave the game at this point. I'll see you when I get back. Okay, we're back. Now we can play Islands. Wait. Okay, I remember this. Yeah, right. You can't play Islands. You need to pay to play this game. Like, the whole game mode is completely locked. So pretty much a whole fraction of Pixel Paradise... You just can't do anything. So you know that's great. Alright, let's head to the last game, Cook Craft. Alright, we're here. Okay, so basically... This is a restaurant simulator. This is actually kind of cool. It's a shame it had to be on this server. Get back here, you can't escape from me. Man, the guy got away with my money, no! Okay, nice, I finally finished the day. And great, once again, I have absolutely no idea how to get out of here. So I'm just going to go and leave again. Now, I'm going to say this about Pixel Paradise. It actually has a couple of cool concepts, but for every just cool or interesting thing they have they just have a bunch of lazy uninspired ripoffs of a bunch of other minecraft mini games where they just don't really add anything to them or the games are just really odd compared to almost every other server's version of the game i'm gonna be honest this does pretty much deserve the title of the worst featured minecraft server because a lot of the stuff this server does is done a lot better on every single other server. But once again, there is a couple of cool things here. So some of the mini games I mentioned, you should try and play those if you want to. And who knows, you might actually have a really good time. But if those mini games which I talked positively about don't really interest you, then there's really no reason for you to play this server. So yeah guys, I hope you all enjoyed today's video. And if you did enjoy this video, go check out some of this content which is here on screen yes i brought that back it's been a while since i said that and if you enjoyed this video go check out some of my other content that i just blip out of reality and if you really enjoyed this video subscribe and yeah i hope you all enjoyed and i'll see you guys in the next one